Hi, my name is Taka from 1OK Rock, watching you, Ambi. Hey everyone, it's Alicia from Ambi, and I would like to welcome you to an interview with one of my favorites, Taka from 1OK Rock. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? I'm good, it's been a while. Thanks for chatting again. Yeah, it's been a long time. Congrats on the release of your new record, Ambitions. Thank you, thank you so much. How does it feel to finally release new music? It's been a while. It's really good. I feel like, you know, uh, this time uh, we made a Japanese version, English version at the same time. Uh, but um, I think um, both of them are really good. So um, I'm really excited to reach to uh, the new American fans. And uh, Canadian fans too, and also Asian fans too. Well, for the record, the cover is a very vibrant yellow, and it just yes. has the record title over it. Yellow represents hope. Yes, so, what were you exactly. feeling hopeful about when you were putting the album together? Like, uh, don't give up, and then, you know, uh, our fans, like Super Yank fans, still over there. So, I mean, um, I, I want to say just um, don't give up and, and just, just keep it going. That's my, um, that's my message. That's our message, actually, yeah. Well, 35 is the first record that you recorded in America. Mm -hmm. So seeing that this is the second, do you feel like you had the groove down now? Was it a lot easier this time around? Yeah, um, the first time was uh, pretty nervous, our members, because, um, um, you know, we couldn't speak, n like, English not not good well. But um, this time is... I'm getting better, like, um, in my, our English is, like, improved right now. So um, we can easy to contact our new producers and then uh, other pr producers, too. So, um, yeah, this time is really, we, ha we had a great time. When I was listening to the record, I was so stoked on all the collaborations that you had on there. Yeah. It was everybody from Five Seconds to Summer, Avril Lavigne, you had yeah. Alex from All Time Low. It's pretty yes. stocked right there. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's crazy, right? Uh, but um, I'm super excited because um, um, uh, we had a twirling with Five Seconds of Summer last year. And uh, actually, at the same time, we met Avril Lavigne uh, in Canada. Actually, it was Toronto, though. And um, uh, we had a good conversation and then exchange for a number and then a texting and over texting. And um, um, yeah, just very organic happened. So um, I'm really, really good feeling right now. Just speaking about really cool acts, when you were on Instagram, you were posting about so many bands who have been sharing the yes. news about the record. Yes. I feel like you have the whole alternative scene behind you. So mm -hmm. From Fall Out Boy, The Used, Good Charlotte, Yellow Card, Against the Current, all of your buddies yeah. are supporting you. So what's it feel like to have so much support over here from people? Um, I don't know. It's super, super, I feel like really, really good. Because um, when I was young, I was, I, we, we like, all the time listening to them like I used a good Charlotte you know what I mean like so um like kind of dream <laughs> <laughs> well the title like ambitions I have to ask is there anything left that you really want to still tackle anything you really want to still do oh yeah 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 like yeah I want a more twirling in the whole world and then I want to do more like uh make a friends like a good friends like other country too so um yeah, and then also, I just want to uh, reach to uh, our new staff, like ambitions to the other fans too. So um, yeah, we have a lots of ambitions. I remember you once described yourself as a smart koala. So I didn't know what you meant by that. Or if there are any animals you feel you relate to the most. Uh, the animal? I don't know. I like ducks, but um, <laughs> <laughs> dogs. Yeah. Do you have any? No, actually. I guess it's pretty hard when you're on the road and stuff, right? Exactly. So, but other members uh, have it just one ducks, but um, we, we had all the time twirling in the world, so it's pretty difficult how to get to ducks. You posted a photograph on your Instagram with pro kickboxer Takeru. Are you a big oh, yeah. fan of kickboxing or wrestling? Exactly. My my favorite like sports. Oh, awesome. Yeah. I like UFC and uh, K1 and then Lessing, something like that. So I love it. If you were to create your own wrestling or kickboxing persona, who would you be if you were to battle I, somebody? I don't know. I don't want, I don't want to fight. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I like just watching. So, um, um, yeah, I like just watching. Okay. I don't want to be fight. No. <laughs> no. No fight. <laughs> so you'll just indulge. <laughs> you'll, you'll just watch everything. Yeah, take, yeah, take yeah. it all in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then strap everything up. Is there anything you want to leave with all of your fans who will be viewing? Just any parting words for everybody? 
Uh, can I say something? Yeah, like go to ahead. the fans. Um, hi, I'm One OK Rock. Uh, I'm I'm Taka from One OK Rock. So um, thank you for supporting us uh all the time. So um, we're here and then we're gonna touring uh more, I hope uh, on this year. So um, see you soon and then. Thank you for supporting us every time. That's it. I just want to say thank you so much for joining me again. No, thank you. I feel like it's a long time coming to catch up, so I appreciate it. Yeah, no I problem. Like second time around, we should bring it in? Yeah, yeah, thank yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> thank you. And remember to everybody viewing, you can visit us at amusicblogger.com for all exclusive interviews, features, videos, and so much more with your favorite bands. See you next time.